Stand up for us, stand up tall Shoulders straight against the wall Your best now, you bow your head Say oh, it's all right, yes man I feel it, I feel it Like a man I'm trying to make your way up here What's my problem? Because we're coming close to the witching hour, right? Yeah, happens at the witching hour. And you know what happens at the witching hour, right? Just a second. Take your way up on the stage, over right here. Oh, Mr. Hall, make your way up on the stage over right here. Give him a big round of applause. There you go. Now, that sounds like girl. That sounds like girl. Mr. Christian, would you stand right here? And Mr. Hall, I have something for you. It's here. I just need you to hold this. Just stand right there. That's perfect. Do you know what's in there? Don't don't Very guess. Lightweight. It could be anything, but it's small. It has a question mark. So nobody knows what's in there but me. As a matter of fact, if I was to reach behind your ear, Mr. Joel, like this, and pull something out, what would I pull out? A hair. Lint. Lint. <laughs> if I was to reach behind your ear, Jamie, and pull something out, what would I pull out? A penny. A penny. That's good. Think bigger, though. You're young. What if I was to reach behind your ear, what would I pull out? <laughs> How about you back there, sir? If I was to pull something out of here, what would I get? Somebody said a dildo, but don't say that. <laughs> Who said quarter? Quarter is good, because your uncle always pulls quarters out of your ear. Right? Um, and if you had a quarter like this, it would be like this now. James, we're going to play a game on this whole audience here. I'm going to lie. That's what I do for a living. I'm going to lie. I didn't even wear a jacket. That's how good of a liar I want to be tonight. I'm going to lie, but you're going to tell the truth. Okay? okay yeah. You're going to tell the truth. Yeah. And James is going to stand over there with his question mark. Now, this quarter that we just magically pulled out of here that wasn't Lynn, wasn't ear wax, wasn't an orange. God knows we didn't want it to be the other thing. <laughs> <laughs> but it's like a good quarter to you, right? Now, do me a favor. I want you to look right there. You see a date? You see a date on there? What date did you see? Come up to the microphone, tell everybody what date you see on the coin. Wow. You need to look at it again? Wait. You need my uh, reading glasses? I got, I got. <laughs> 1992. So a quarter with a date of 1992. Now somebody gave me that quarter. Where are they at? It's a late. Oh, right there. And you didn't even know what it was, and I put an envelope, and I said I'm going to use it. James, can you feel in that envelope? Yes. Come on over here. Would you open that envelope up for us? What's in there? A dildo. Oh my God. <laughs> it's a quarter. It's not a dildo. That's the world's smallest dildo. That is a quarter, but real loud in the microphone. What's the date on that? He's looking. 1992. Give him a big round of applause. That's pretty damn good. Well, and the weird thing is, sometimes I, I, I like predictions. Anybody got an iPhone I could borrow? Here, you want mine? You'll get it back. Oh, yeah. Bring it up. I want it to be, do you want it to be yours? Yours is close. Can you unlock it? Oh, okay. Can you put it on the calculator mode for me? This is your phone, right? Okay, good. So there's no pre-programming or anything? Do you, do you need 21 or can I clear it out? Okay. He's like, how old do I have to be to drink? <laughs> oh, yeah. um, so, um, how, how many people are here tonight? It's hard to see with the spot on. 21. 21. <laughs> I love you, girl. You're awesome. All right, so we're going to play a game with Jamie's phone. And Jamie, I'm not going to let anybody take your phone. But, um, Shelly, would you do me a favor? I want you to enter any four-digit number in there. Don't hit anything but the four digits that you want. Okay, that works. Can you can you add a four-digit number? Oh, that'll work too. Multiply, whatever. Multiply, that works. Just I get predictions good so wrong. Now, Jamie, do me a favor. Hold that out. She hit the multiplier. That's fine. And what's, what's the number that we got on there? 53,045. 53, I gotta write it down. 53, I, I don't ever get these wrong. 
53,045. 45? Yes. All right, 53,045. Because I was in my garage this afternoon, and this sheet here, I wrote I wrote something down on it. Now do me a favor, James, would you step on this end right here? Right here, like so, at the corner. Hold it up real high so everybody can see it. It says shoes. 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 53045. And we said shoes. Oh God. How does you know it's weird sometimes when I'm making what? these things up and I'm doing all this stuff out. It's it's what? Turn it around. Turn it around? What does it say if you turn it upside down? Whoa! I'm always surprised. I'm always surprised by this. Well you know what's weird? You always do tricks in threes, right? You always do tricks in threes? Ladies and gentlemen. Red fucking car! 